This one is on fair. They were buying in groups. Uh -huh. elderly people. That. This is a residential area. Uh, and here the volunteers are needed to do what? Volunteers are needed. It's a care home. Uh -huh. Are we turning even in a large? The toast way. Any piggies. So this one has a name. Huh? This residential area. Yeah, it is residential, but it's in big in the care home. Care homes are these ones. Uh, care homes are where they put in elderly. elderly people. Elderly people, when you have a chronic illness, then those who cannot be taken care of in the, by their own people. So there are those who have no relatives. Yes. Uh -huh. And the funny thing is that you find out that you can die. And then, uh -huh. you also find people with uh, conditions, chronic conditions. Yeah. So they fund their own bills, they pay their own bills in the care homes. The elderly? Yes. From their pension? Whatever. Now, in old age, you know, most people maybe have retired. Yes. Uh -huh. So if you had a house, uh -huh. they'll sell your house. Oh. And from that sale, uh -huh. that money will be used to take care of you. Uh -huh. Oh, that's how it operates. Mm -hmm. So it's not funded by government. Uh -huh. It's not funded by government. No, so for some, uh -huh. it's funded. For some, straight ahead. So it's like you will find out what services they provide before you choose. Yes. So you choose best again on your budget. Ah. Can you pay for the service or not? Okay. So when do they discharge them? Or they stay there till they die? In Mensha, yeah. it's a lifelong. Yeah. So they'll be there for as long as they And uh, but what they do, uh -huh. they, if they have relatives, our relatives, they come busy, sometimes they take them home, things like that. There's uh -huh. something else they call respite care. So respite care yeah. is when you as my husband 
have been taken care of me. Mm. But then, it reaches a point, I'm tired. You know, you are tired caring, caring for caregivers. There's something about caring for caregivers as well. Uh, you know? uh -huh. you, it, it's difficult to take care of, say, for example, a patient, uh, patient with dementia. Uh. So when you get to that point when you're tired, you need to rest for some time. Yeah. You take your relative to care. So they're there for maybe say one month. So like now and, and, and then mm. there are those care homes. Like uh, there's a care home in the city, a place called probably occupy hospital beds for a much longer time. Mm. So they mm. are cared for by the district nurses. Mm -hmm. And then how we become a community nurses in short. And then oh the younger nations. Uh -huh. The strawberries. There is a bus stop here. Yeah. If you can explain this. So, those are different buses. That's number two to Bolton and to Victoria Hospital. That's number two C to Mot N via Bolton and that's number 12 to High Cross via Miss Farm. That's number four to Fleetwood and those are the buses that will stop here. There are no other buses that are going to stop here. Then you have the times each day. So from Monday to Friday those are the times that the bus will stop here. And the payment is the same. Yeah, the well. payment is the same. Actually, actually now, uh, the government extended it to help, you know, to help households. It's even written here. Yeah. It, it was more than this. So it was supposed to be 250 you get. So there's a subsidy. So they subsidy. The government helped, helped households. So it is now two pounds. A club. Eh? The racing the bar. I've seen even Guinness. I thought Guinness was from our country. Yeah, what for now? Ah. You said you were talking Ah. Areas pay more. Let's 
see no cards. Adam and Eve didn't have kids. <laughs> Spongy. Very beautiful. Eh. Talk some medicine, yo. Yani uku? Regulations zao. Mimi Regulations. So what do you do? Thank you. 